All right, I don't want to take you much longer than I said I would. We're so thankful, David, for your great insight, and I'm very appreciative of you and also for you forgiving me uh, eight, nine years ago when I said mean things about you before I really really thought you were for real and, and had grown myself. So I just want to tell you before you leave us that I really appreciate you, David. Uh, let's, no problem, mate. In closing, David, a lot is going on, a lot is happening, and I don't put on a lot of events, but if six months – down the road, I wanted to get a hall that held like 5,000 people uh, where, say, uh, I would speak one day and you would speak another day. Uh, and, uh, I mean, would you entertain uh, off-air? i jump at it, Alex. i jump at it. You know, we guys have got to, you know, support each other and, 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 uh, and uh, let our, our differences, uh, you know, go over a beer. David, I don't think we have any. Uh, I don't no, think no, we... I was, I was just going to say, small as, small as they're now becoming. Um, and, and just focus together on, on what affects us all, which is, which is the freedom of, yeah. of, of everybody. Well, well, so I would jump at it, mate, yeah. Well, me too. Well, and let's, let's set it up. Let's do it. I'll call you in a, in, a, in a week or so whenever you get back to England. When are you getting back to England? Uh, uh, end of the week, I'll be there. Okay, well, I'll let you rest. I'll call you in about a week and a half or so. I just wanted to say that the, what, upset, what, what concerns me is that my guts, my instincts, whatever you want to call it, my sixth sense tells me to work with you, tells me that you're right, and it, it, it's just so crazy to realize that reality is so false. Yeah. Uh, and it, it, it's it's amazing, but we're to, we're all together in this. And like you said, I look into your eyes and, and see myself. You look into mine, I see yours. We look into a woman's eyes in the street. We look back at humanity and this great journey. And so, David Icke, thank you so much for all the time. DavidIcke.com. Tell the listeners about your latest book. Uh, well, it's, uh, it's a massive work called The David Icke Guide to the Global Conspiracy, in which I, I pull all together um, the, the, all the different elements. And the first two chapters are all that we've been talking to, about today in great detail. And the first two chapters, because once we understand the nature of reality, the nature of the society that's been created for us starts to become crystal clear. David Icke, amazing interview. Thank you for the two-plus hours, and I um, hope to have you up every few months when uh, your schedule allows, and I hope to uh, see you in person uh, sometime here in Texas. Take care. That'll be great. Cheers, Alex. Bye. Take care. There goes David Icke. Look, whether you love David Icke or hate David Icke, he, he is for real. He means what he's saying. And like I said, I agree with about 98% of what he has to say, and he's really a classy guy. You know, I called him on international television, the turd and the punch bowl, because people back then weren't ready to wake up to even wilder things. And I said, you know, he covers all these things that are true and then goes even further. But what he says about the elite, I have researched and found that they believe it's true. So whether it's the truth or not, uh, whether they're in touch with different entities or not, you know, I'm not crazy for reporting on the fact that the elite believe that they're doing that.